I asked my opponent, Denny Heck, at one town hall recently, I stood up and I respectfully asked him, I said, you know, um, and I actually said, with all due respect, do you not support single payer because it would go against the interests of the insurance companies who incidentally, when I look at your campaign finance reports, are the biggest donors to your campaign, is that why? You know what he said? Just like most polit politicians do. His answer was not an answer. It was a polished, rehearsed, platitude pivoting, as I think Van Jones says, non-burger. <laughs> no meat and no cheese in there. He didn't, he, he didn't answer the question. All, you know, what he says in regard to why he's against single payer, <laughs> which is kind of ironic. You know, he says, what about all the insurance company people that lose their jobs? <laughs> nursing home people that don't lose their jobs. Really? What about the people that are going to lose their lives if they don't have it? What about that? <laughs> Representative Heck. I thought it was notable that within his platitudes, he looked me in the eye and says, you know what, Tambourine, if you feel that you have to look at campaign finance reports, that's fine. You can go ahead and do that. But I've led a, a career of serving the people and I sleep well at night. He said that. I was being probably a little too respectful because I would have said, I bet you do, Representative Heck. I bet you do.